Features of Z80 Microprocessor 1. Zilog Z80 is an 8-bit microprocessor. It is manufactured by Zilog Incorporated. It is more powerful than Intel 8085 microprocessor. 2. It includes 8085 instructions as a subset. 3. The different version of Z80 microprocessor. A. Z80. B. Z80A. C. Z80B. D. Z80H. Are operated at various frequencies ranging from 2.5 MHz to 8 MHz. 4. It needs external oscillator circuit to provide the operating frequency and appropriate control signals to communicate with memory and I.O. device. 5. It is 40 pin dual inline DIP package. 6. It was launched in July 1976 and was widely used in both desktop computers and embedded systems including military applications. Embedded system or those system in which software is installed in hardware. 7. A special reset function which clears only the program counter, pin 1 to 5A11 to A15, and pin 31 to 40A1 to A10. These pin are output pins. 1. These pin are called address pin. This is used to carry address of memory registers and I.O. input. Output Devices 2. This pin are unidirectional. As we know that address is always flow in the one direction form microprocessor to memory or microprocessor to input, output device, so it is unidirectional. 3. It is capable of addressing of 2 to the power 16 memory registers. Pin 6. Clock. It is input pin. It is used to provide frequency to the microprocessor. As we know that Z80 does not contains clock circuit on chip. Pin 7 to 10. Pin 12 to 15. It is bidirectional lines used to data transfer. It is bidirectional because data is flow form microprocessor to memory or I.O. device and vice versa. Pin 11 and pin 29. Pin 11 VSS and pin 29 GND or VCC. Plus 5 volts DC is connected to pin 11 and minus 5 volts DC is connected to pin 29. As we gives these pin input voltage. These pin are input pin, pin 16. INT. Interrupt request. It is input pin. 1. Dot this is active low signal. It mean there is bar over it and when it is low it means it is not in. Working state. When it is high then it is working state. 2. It is trigger or initiated by external device like DMA, direct memory. ASUS, to interrupt the microprocessor operation. 3. It is maskable meaning it can be disabled by software. 4. INT is trigger, then microprocessor send acknowledges to external device to activating or active low, signal. During M1 machine cycle, pen 17. NMI. Non maskable interrupt. Input pin. 1. This active low signal. 2. It is non maskable interrupt. It means it cannot disable by software. 3. It is activated by a negative edge triggered signal from an external source as it is input signal. 4. There is no signal or pin for acknowledge it. Pin 18. Halt. It is an output pin. 1. It is an active low pin. 2. Used to indicate that the microprocessor has executed the halt instruction. Pin 19. MREQ. Memory request. It is an output pin. 1. This is an active low tri state signal. 2. When it is in low state, it indicates that address bus holds a valid address for a memory read or writes operation. Pin 20. IORQ. Input output request. It is an output pin. 1. It is an active low signal. 2. Low status indicates that I.O. operation is in progress. High status indicates that I.O. operation is terminated or stop. Pin 21. Road, read. It is an output pin. 1. It is an active low pin. 2. 
reads data form memory or an I.O. device. It means when this pin is in active low state then this indicates that microprocessor is ready to read data from memory or an I.O. device. 3. Road plus MREQ equals MEMRD, all signal is an active low signal. When read signal is combined with memory request then the signal is used to memory read. 4. Road plus IORQ equals IORD, all signal is an active low signal. When read signal is combined with input output request then the signal is used to read input output device pin 22. WR, right, output pin. 1. It is an active low pin. 2. Write data into memory or an I.O. device. It means when this pin is in active low state then this indicates that microprocessor has already placed data byte on the data bus and is ready to write into memory or an I.O. device. 3. WR plus MRAQ equals MEMWR, all signal is an active low signal. When write signal is combined with memory request then the signal is used to write into the memory. 4. WR plus IORQ equals IOWR, all signal is an active low signal. When write signal is combined with input, output request then the signal is used to write on IO device. Pin 23. BUSAK, bus acknowledge, output pin. 1. It is an active low pin. 2. It is initiated by the Z80 in response to the request signal sent by external device like DMA direct memory access, device. 3. Microprocessor have no control over data bus, address bus and control signals. As bus acknowledge is initiated the address bus, the data bus and the control signal goes high impedance it means microprocessor have no control over bus. It give all control to requesting device that is DMA in our case. 4. It is similar to HLDA in 8085. Pin 24. Wait, input pin. 1. It is an active low pin. 2. It is similar to ready in 8085. 3. Use for add clock cycles to memory or I.O. devices to extend the Z80 operation. When this signal goes low, it indicates to the microprocessor that the addressed memory or I.O. devices is slower than that of the Z80. 4. Signal is used when the response time of memory or I.O. devices is slower than that of the Z80. Pin 25. BUSRQ, bus request, input pin. 1. It is an active low signal. 2. Request for bus control from external device. It is similar to hold in 8085. 3. It is initiated by external devices such as DMA, direct memory access. An I.O. device can send a low signal to bus request to use of address bus, the data bus, and the control signals. The external device can use the buses, and when its operations are complete, it returns the control to the microprocessor. 4. Recognized at the end of the current machine cycle. It is observed by the microprocessor in end of every machine cycle. Pin 26. Reset, input pin. 1. It is an active low pin. 2. Used to reset the microprocessor. When reset is activated, program counter PC, interrupt register L, and the memory refresh register R are all clear to zero. 3. During reset time address bus and data bus is on high impedance. It means microprocessor will not able to use address bus and data bus during reset period. 4. It is activated by external switch or key. Active for at least 3 clock periods to complete the reset operation. It need 3 clock periods because it is used to clear program counter, interrupt register and memory refresh register. Pin 27. M1, Machine Cycle 1. Output Pin. 1. It is an active low pin. Active low indicating that an opcode is being fetched from memory. 2. It is used in an interrupt operation to generate interrupt acknowledge signal. Pin 28. RFSH, refresh, output pin. 1. It is an active low signal. 
active low signal indicating that the address bus A6 to A0, low order 7 bits, holds a refresh address of dynamic memory. 2. It should be used in conjunction with memory request MEMRQ to refresh memory content.